Monitoring school bus routes this morning after a rocky start on the first day of classes for some families. WREL is your back to school headquarters. WREL is now heard live at the bus yard watching for any delays or mishaps that could happen today. Good morning, Naya. Good morning, Ken. Yeah, we are already noticing that. Taking a look at Wake County Schools updates that they post on uh, their website, they are keeping that updated every 15 minutes. And so far, we have seen a number of delays, uh, more than a dozen of those bus driver routes that are currently uncovered, which means that uh, those parents are going to have to find alternate uh, transportation for their children this morning to get to school. This, as the district is still dealing with this bus driver shortage, and we know that uh, these bus drivers are already having to pull that extra duty. Now, this also means that it could be long days for students as well who are trying to get to school and get from school. Yesterday, parents expressing that concern with WRAL and on social media, saying for some of them that it took uh, two hours for their child to get home. WRAL did talk with the district official who says that first day problems are to be expected. They are trying to uh, work that all out, but they do encourage parents to check the Here Comes the Bus app so parents can know what is going on with their child's bus and if it is going to be covered or if there's going to be a substitute driver. Now, we'll continue to keep you updated this morning on what we're seeing when it comes to the elementary schools. Naya Harden, WREL News in Raleigh.